We're transforming the ogre into something here, and it's extremely pleasing. The tragedy is all but gone, and, and the miserable circumstances that people get into are simply p p p pathetic. I'm sharpening stones with this glorified apocrypha. The empty and the neutral. The absolute is so crucial. Take it in yourself. Let it be exposed and vulnerable. And all is beautiful. Stand by these things and do them in it. Do them out of it. Do them not of it, but above it. And enter it fully. Prove there's more. I'm trapped. I understand. I represent. And I'm embraced. And it includes it all. Some poor, some great flickering thrillé. It's radiance. It's radiance. It's clover. It's warm and sympathetic, and it's jabbering to be awoke. Below the horizon line, there are soft cushions and their glorified comfort. So take care, don't worry. Daily it is. Dirty, senseless, without meaning. But don't get victimized. Be humble. Be without question. And simple. It's perfection. Release it. Outside. In its source. Mania. Is possessed. Striking deep with a laugh. I'm intoxicated. I'm divine, so drink it and taste it, take all these obscenities and spark them together so they can be touched, let them be liberated, not tragic, hit the crux, train towards nowhere, nourish the revolt, the dilemma isn't grand enough for that appeal, probe, cast, grade, be perilous, and get closer to pasts. Get naked and be desperate and be excellent. Just like the saviors that were waited, and they were good, they were bad, but they were denied. It's the grinding noise of the chain. 